Months ago, Carlos Alcaraz was a random upcoming tennis player, but now he's beginning to look more than that. Now, he's in the top 10 for the first time, and it seems like he's gunning for the top spot. What do other tennis stars think about this rising star? Is he a threat to them? Well, we'll find out. Here is what Andy Murray thinks about the youngster. Multiple Grand Slam winner Andy Murray once described that he was impressed with how strong Carlos Alcaraz is at just 18 years old. The former world number one recently enjoyed Alcaraz and Stefanos Tsitsipas clash against each other on the clay courts of Barcelona. Alcaraz defeated Tsitsipas in this quarterfinal match, and after the match, Murray retweeted, Tsitsipas and Alcaraz are brilliant to watch. Loads of variety, great movers. Andy Murray picked a trio of young players he felt could win Grand Slams and become the new Big Three. The players are Stefanos Tsitsipas, Carlos Alcaraz, and Daniil Medvedev. He explained that he liked watching Alcaraz. Though he is a little young, he has the potential to be a tennis great, a truly top player. In a pre-match conference ahead of a second round Indian Wells clash with Alcaraz, Murray echoed the compliments of many pundits, describing the Spanish youngster as a fantastic player with bags of potential. He revealed that only a few players could reach the top level, but from watching Alcaraz, he didn't see that many flaws for the young player. In the same interview, Murray also admitted that he thought Alcaraz to be extremely strong and flexible in the way he moves around the court. Another advantage he feels Alcaraz has is the ability to play well on clay and hard courts, which isn't the same for all young players. It's obvious that Andy is a big fan of the youngster, as he's always seen in the stands whenever Alcaraz has a match. According to the British champion, he hopes Alcaraz can continue to build on his strengths and improve. Stefano Tsitsipas, who is one of the players Murray tipped alongside Carlos Alcaraz to emerge as the new big three and dominate world of tennis, also praises the young star. After a surprising loss to Carlos Alcaraz in the third round of the US Open, Tsitsipas praised Alcaraz, stating that the Spanish teen could be a contender for Grand Slam titles. He revealed that he had never seen anybody hit the ball as hard as Alcaraz. If you recall, Murray also made the same observation. Must be one sick forearm he's got there. Tsitsipas admitted that Alcaraz's ball speed was incredible, and it took him time to adjust to his speed and power. He explained that he had never seen anyone play as well as Alcaraz in the fifth set. Alcaraz appeared to be done in the game after getting bageled in the fourth set, coupled with the fact that he was also dealing with an upper leg issue. But against all odds, the Spanish kid made a wonderful comeback and overcame his leg issues to upset Tsitsipas. Tsitsipas praised Alcaraz's mental strengths and toughness after the game, explaining that the Spaniard dealt with his issues well during the game. He expressed that such a mentality was going to help Alcaraz reach the top, as well as turn him into the player he is meant to be. In a recent interview, 24-year-old Andre Rublev expressed his feelings about Carlos Alcaraz and highlighted comparisons between their respective Spanish coaches. Rublev hailed Alcaraz's love for the game as well as the massive talent that Alcaraz possesses. He explained that Alcaraz made everything faultless at the exact time. He recalled saying, the first thing is his enormous talent. The second is that he really loves tennis playing, working, and not what he can get from tennis that doesn't matter to him, and you can easily see that. In the same interview, when Rublev was asked if he found similarities between his association with his coach Fernando Vicente and Alcaraz's coach Juan Carlos, he explained that Juan Carlos started coaching Alcaraz at a really young age, and he couldn't imagine himself with another coach on tour. He further went on to explain that it took him and Alcaraz three to four seasons to reach their current level. According to Rublev, the reason why Alcaraz is so good is because he started working with legendary Juan Carlos at a very young age and feels that has helped the teenager build his game. The Russian also expressed that Juan Carlos is the perfect coach for Carlos Alcaraz. 
He described their combination as magnificent, stating that Alcaraz, at his age, made a perfect choice with Juan Carlos. It's no surprise that every individual who has played against the Spaniard has had a tough time and has one or two things to say about him. But moving away from the men's tennis, fellow teenager Emma Raducanu, who is currently the world's number 11, is also impressed with the star. When Emma Raducanu was asked for her views on Carlos Alcaraz, the 19-year-old, who certainly knows about winning trophies as a teenager, expressed that she thought Alcaraz was incredible. But what was more impressive for her was the fact that Alcaraz was usually genuine and kind off the court. She said it's incredible how the Spanish star is able to practically take a racket out of his opponent's hand. It is definitely very exciting, she added. Just like Alcaraz, Radu Kanu has enjoyed a rapid rise of the rankings, and the British star has enjoyed watching his journey. Multiple Grand Slam winner Naomi Osaka expressed that it was incredibly impressive what Alcaraz managed to achieve at 18. She lauded him for creating an extraordinary level of entertainment for the sport. She revealed that Alcaraz had added a new spark to the ATP Tour, which she was seeing for the first time in a long while. She said that it felt like she was watching Alcaraz grow and learn with every tournament because of his game style and charisma. Osaka explained that she watched almost all the tournaments he's played in so far, and it was really exciting for herself and everyone to see the growth. In an interview about the upcoming Madrid Open, she revealed that she was looking forward to watching Carlos Alcaraz. Osaka also revealed that she sometimes forgets his age till she was reminded that he is just a teen. Casper Ruud is among recent tennis stars to praise Carlos Alcaraz's effort. He labeled Alcaraz a rare talent that you don't come across very often. If you don't play against the man, you just might not know. After defeating Rude at the Miami Open, Alcaraz became the youngest to win the event and also the third youngest behind Michael Chang and Rafael Nadal to win a Masters 1000 title. Rude and many other fans believe it is the start of things to come for the young Spaniard. He explained on the Rude Talk vodcast that if we look back in history, players like Alcaraz usually ended up winning big titles and going far in their careers. He appears to be really impressed with the Spaniards so far. According to Rude, he expects the younger to get better as the years roll by with lots of practice and hard work. Rude explained that Alcaraz is blessed with a good team around him. His coach Juan Carlos has experience being number one before. Rude believes Carlos's goal would be to produce another world number one, the second version of himself in a way. He also empathized some important features of Alcaraz's game, saying he was fearless and went for big shots at big moments without holding back. He deemed it very impressive. Rude explained that Alcaraz often went with lots of power and risky shots. It rarely seemed risky, but as a player himself, he was often surprised Alcaraz went for certain shots. Gail Monfils once tipped Alcaraz to achieve big things after their Indian Wales clash. Monfils was unsuccessful in his first match against the Spaniards. Alcaraz defeated him to make his first Masters quarterfinal. The Frenchman expressed that Alcaraz has his whole life ahead of him to accomplish exceptional things, which is exactly what he is doing. If you haven't played Carlos, you just might not know how good he is. Current world number two, Daniil Medvedev, also heaped praises on Carlos. Daniil Medvedev once defeated Carlos Alcaraz in straight sets at Wimbledon in 2021, where he later spoke very highly of the youngster. He feels Carlos is an amazing player. He also said he was surprised with the first set of the game. Medvedev insinuated that grass might not be Alcaraz's best surface, but the youngster gave it his all against him. He predicted that Alcaraz was going to eventually make it into the top 10, a feat Alcaraz has finally achieved. Medvedev, like many others, also admits that he felt what Alcaraz is doing is incredible, especially at a young age. 
While awaiting the winner in a game between Alcaraz and Hugo Gaston, Medvedev confessed that he felt old when he thought about Alcaraz and Gaston. He explained that he was ranked 700 when he was 18 years old, but what Alcaraz is doing at a similar age is just incredible. What do you think about Carlos Alcaraz? Do you think he's worth all the praises? Comment below.